Hmm? E-waste. Oh, so it stands for electrical and electronic waste. Imagine, uh, you throw away about 70 handphones a year. <laughs> it amounts to about 11 kg of e-waste that you're producing every year? Well, you know, <laughs> you don't actually throw away all your handphones. You throw away the less valuable products like your fridge, your washing machine, your TV sets. But they all become e-waste. Do you know how much e-waste Singapore generates every year? 60,000 tons, my friend. Imagine the biggest passenger plane in the world. 60,000 tons is about, what, 220 of them all? Hi, Mr. Lim. My name is Timothy. Hi, Welcome hi, to Similia. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, so tell me, what is the recycling process like in this um, plant? Well, basically Similia is all about uh, urban mining business. So all the e-waste that we collect will be actually convert to raw materials. So of course, in order to convert the raw materials, there's a lot of uh, process that needs to be done, like uh, manual dismantling, okay. segregation, and then uh, you'll be actually converted into like uh, power ports, uh, PCB, power supplies, uh, plastics, ferrous and non-ferrous metals, and basically so many different kind of uh, components from there. So where do the recyclables end up? No, that's a very good question. So basically, like ferrous and non-ferrous metals, uh, we do send it to the smelters where they actually do the smelting process where they can actually convert to new metals. For the plastics, uh, we send to the downstream vendors where they can actually convert the plastics into plastic resins. And of course, the PCB boards that has precious metals like the gold, silver, palladium, this will be our expertise. So we'll be doing the refining process in our facility here. So why is this program important? Well, this program is very important because it's, you know, it's about our nation in how to prevent pollution and with the proper facility, this will actually ensure that all these e-waste are properly treated mm -hmm. and recycled in an environment-friendly way. And you just imagine if there's no such a facility in Singapore, where will these e-waste go to? We we'll probably end up in general waste and general waste will end up in installation plant. And when they burn these e-waste, it's bad for the environment. So tell me, what are some of the precious metals that you find along your way? Well, uh, there has to be gold, silver, palladium, and of course, uh, copper. So this is the most common I always deal with uh, almost in every day in my job when I deal with all these e-waste from the customers. You know, I used to be a security guard myself. So security to me was very important. The day when I decided to recycle my memory card, I was so afraid that my information would be leaked out. But you know, in this plant, they tell me that everything is collectively secured and crashed. Well, obviously, I feel much more secured now. And let me let you into a little secret. Do you know that there's gold in our phone? Yeah, gold. Trust me. What? <laughs>